everybody, it's Steve from Pet Alliance with Great Orlando. Welcome to this edition of the Shelter Stars video. So these videos are created just for our very special monthly donors, and you're one of them, so you're getting to see it today. And we're all about trap, neuter, return. So this kind of looks a little funky, but these are our trap cages. So if you're not familiar with trap, neuter, return, it's when you have feral cats or colony cats out in the community in large quantities and we go out and trap them and we alter them, snip snip, spay or neuter, and then we return them to their community. So they have feeders and people that care for them, but we just don't want them reproducing because we get thousands of kittens every year. And Florida doesn't really have a traditional kitten season because of our temperate weather, as you can see, it's a, well, you probably can't see, but it is a beautiful day out today. Uh, and cats can reproduce two, sometimes three times a year. Uh, so when we alter them and take care of a colony and that colony doesn't continue to reproduce cats that live outside, that's the beauty of TNR. So you'll hear us talk about it. It is one of our core strategic initiatives. We're very focused on this for the next six, seven years. Uh, you'll be hearing us talk about TNR. We are focusing on different areas of Orange County, very specifically. At this point, Osceola is being taken care of by Osceola Animal Services in a program they have. And currently, Seminole doesn't have a TNR program. They have some ordinances that don't permit you to actively TNR. So we'll be working on that in the future. But right now, we're focusing on Orange County and the different areas. We go in two mile like radiuses and really get all of those cats in that radius. And we go, then we go to the adjacent neighborhood, the adjacent neighborhood. But these are pretty nifty. Um, this, can I open this? Just slides in. We put some really great smelling um, tuna, sometimes sardines. That really gets the cat's attention. They come in, back there, trap releases, and then we pick them up later that day and take them to our Alafaya clinic where we do the surgeries every Friday. We do upwards of 40 surgeries. I think to date we've done just under 1,400 and our goal for this year by the end of the year is 1,500 so I know we'll hit that target and that means that we probably prevented a minimum of 4,500 kittens from being born in the wild. That's a minimum. That's, I'm giving you a very conservative estimate on that. Um, so we're excited about that. This is the van. It was generously donated by um, one of our lovely patrons. And we put the cats in here. We transport them. And then we do the surgery and keep them overnight, make sure that they're doing well. And then we return them to their neighborhood, talk to their feeders, make sure they understand feeding once a day is really what we want. We don't want you feeding multiple times a day or leaving food out. So if you are a feeder and you are a donor and you're seeing this, feed once a day. After 30 minutes, take the food up because you don't want to attract rats, raccoons, coyotes, any other thing that may gravitate to that food. And those are also things that annoy your, your neighbors um, because that attracts other animals to their yards as well. So you know, be considerate of them as well. Um, we go door to door. We'll answer any questions that you have. It's a super exciting program. Um, if you ever want to come out and participate in a trap day or a release day, you are more than welcome. You can contact us. We're happy to have you come out. We do all of our releases on Saturday. So Saturday morning, you know, instead of going and walking in the mall or jogging or going to CrossFit, come out and do a release day. You'll feel really good about it. Uh, you'll get to meet the colony managers. Uh, we're very excited about the program and appreciate all that you've done. I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving with your family. We certainly are grateful for all that you do for us here at Pet Alliance, for our dogs and our cats. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving. We'll talk to you soon.